We are in beautiful Key West. We have had an amazing time, but now we're about to get on this amazing ship and have a ton of fun. So come along with us. I'm Carmen, this is Brian. If you're new here and you enjoy travel videos and other travel tips, be sure to click subscribe and the bell so you won't miss anything. Now we're gonna get blown away. Let's get on the ship. Heading back onto the ship, yay. It's so great when you love the port, but you also love getting back on the ship. Perfect day. I love port days at the buffet. It's prime time for lunch. Hi. And it is wide open. I'm gonna explain our plates this morning. In Key West, Brian got a lobster roll, so he's had lunch. I have not. So I've got steak, chimichurri sauce, baked potato, and some Caribbean rice and green beans. Got some mango and papaya. And here's Brian's little dessert plate. We have this amazing view, sailboat going by. Gorgeous. We're walking through the pool deck, headed to the pool bar for some refreshments. And it's fun, they're, they're playing some kind of trivia and they were just playing the Brady Bunch theme. They only played a few seconds, but I knew what it was right away. Here's the pool bar. This trivia is really funny. I don't know what this is, do you? Funny, you know they're playing the Muppets theme. I think I would have done really good at this trivia. Do you want to lay on that, Brian? Ooh, solarium, it feels so good in here. It smells good too. I think they pipe in some kind of a smell. It smells really nice. Kind of like you're in a spa. Here's the Aqua Spa Cafe. You can get smoothies and that kind of thing here. And usually lighter, fair food. Ooh, salmon salad looks good. Well, this is a disappointment. We came down to the Aqua Spa Cafe because last time they had a ton of gluten-free, sort of healthy fruit and nut bars. Not anymore. The pool bar was super crowded and in the sun, so we came back to the Ocean View Bar, which is aft, which we absolutely love. I mean, you can't beat this view. Look at that. And Brian got a Rebel IPA, and I got a Don Julio on the rocks. I can't speak for Brian, but I think this is actually my favorite bar on the ship. For some reason, it's never crowded. The pool bar was super packed. And also, you have these just stunning views off the back of the ship. So beautiful. That water is so blue. We have now moved up to the lawn area on the top deck to enjoy our drinks. Prop the feet up and enjoy this view of Key West. And it's pretty cool. The Airplanes are coming in this way and the airport's like right over there. So that's fun to watch too. Both of us enjoy aviation. So it's neat to watch the planes come in. Love this natural grass, really cool. Here's an example of the planes coming in right over our heads. Pretty neat. Example of the money too. <laughs> that private jet? Brian just said it's an example of the money in case you couldn't hear him. We just found something new. We knew the grass was up here, but we did not know there was a putting green up here. Oh, wow, way over. Woohoo! Talk about putting with a view. Well, it's full. I think the hole's full. There's so many balls. But look at that water. It looks fake. It's so blue. It's beautiful. We are heading down the stairs to our cabin, which is on the ninth deck. We're going to take a little super short room break and then head back out. Here's the view of Key West from our balcony. Different looking than it was this morning, which was in the previous video. And there's the Coast Guard ship down there. Really, really neat. I have loved this port. It has been really, really, really fun. And staying docked here is nice as well. The views are just spectacular. One thing we didn't talk about is the room we're in this time has one of these pull down beds in the ceiling that uh, we don't need obviously and we have a room tour which I will link above of our other room which did not have this um, but it's really interesting it's right over the couch um, so I'd, I'd love to see that down but you have to actually have them unlock it so we're not going to do that but very interesting. The pool's actually pretty chill that secondary pool has a few kids in it but this pool is almost empty. Beautiful day for the pool for sure. We're sitting on the starboard side of the ship, which this is the same side that our room is on. We're down on the fifth deck, which is a wonderful place to come and relax. 
They do have the life boots or tender boots here, but also this area that's just a nice deck with chairs. They've got a whole row of chairs down here. And on the other side, the port side is the smoking section, but on this side it is not, and it's really lovely. It's buffet snack time. I got a salad with a little tuna on top. This is a pretty interesting viewpoint from the buffet. If you watched our video last week, which I will link in the description below and also up above, we walked all the way to the southern point, which is where that lighthouse is and beyond. There's a little red building behind it, if you can see that, and that's where we went to the southernmost point. And what's funny is we almost walked all the way there, all the way back, and all the way there again, and all the way back. Um, just to do all the things that we wanted to do and the time that we wanted to do them. But it's definitely a lot of walking, but it's totally doable. So unless you have mobility issues, it's a great way to see Key West. This is pretty cool. It is now tea time on the ship, which they have in the afternoon on the buffet. And they've got a gluten-free muffin and a gluten-free scone. That's a pretty great selection. And of course we still got this view. Wow. We are going to head down to the Passport Bar, which is on the third deck. Here's an amazing view from the third deck. This is just incredible. You got that floating tree. Really cool. There are only three minutes left the deadline to where you're supposed to be on the ship there's still a steady stream of people coming back i can't imagine cutting it that close i would be a bundle of nerves it's funny there's other people out on their balcony over here <laughs> watching as well we are sailing away from key west it has been amazing totally recommend this port for sure we're glad we're coming back here on a later cruise it's been such a good time this is interesting, so up here we haven't pushed away that much, but this direction we totally have, so it looks like we're pivoting. Also, I forgot to mention, we're actually backing up right now. We're not going forward. We're backing out of Key West. Right now, the ship has turned, I think, enough. Doesn't look like the thrusters are going anymore, so I think we're turning out to open sea from the front. dinner time we're gonna head to craft social for a drink and then go to the main dining room for dinner the time to come to craft social is not busy at all we got a moscow mule and brian got the fendemon we have come to the main dining room we love eating here the food is so amazing what are you gonna get tonight brian have you decided yet Scallop crudo looks interesting. Oh wow. Got my gluten-free bread and we have mystery dips. We're not sure what they are tonight. And Brian's got his basket of bread. There's Brian's scallop crudo. That looks so good. So beautiful. The presentation is really amazing. Jalapeno too. Oh wow. <laughs> And then I got the escargot, which is gluten-free. All right, Brian's gonna try the scallop crudo. Get some jalapeno. That's gonna be spicy. Did you even get any scallop in that bite? Mm. Is that good? It's a tasty bite. 
Good heat. Good eats. Good heat. <laughs> Got the escargot. Mm. So good, very garlicky, which I love. We both got the trout. It looks so incredible. Do you want to try yours? Definitely uh, tasting trout. Really good. Really amazing. I mean, why is the seafood just so good? They must have just super fresh seafood. So good. Uh, the skin's really good. It's amazing. Here's Quasar, one of their bars. They have karaoke in here pretty frequently. They open a little later at night. Pretty fun. We're headed into the Equinox Theater. It is comedy night. During this seven night cruise, they had two different comedians on different nights. The early showing on Celebrity is a family friendly show and that's the version that we went and saw and we enjoyed both comedians. Definitely recommend checking out whatever live entertainment they have. If you've enjoyed this video, be sure to click on the video on your screen right now and hit subscribe so you won't miss anything new. Thanks so much for watching. Until our next adventure.